Hey y'all, it's Shantia and I'm back with another banger, another video, okay? So listen y'all, the title or the topic for today is Christmas came early, but the second part is that the floodgates are heaven are open. Listen, child. So yesterday I was driving, right? And I'm driving past the 7-Eleven that I always drive past. But for some reason, the 7-Eleven sign was just sticking out to me, right? The number 7-Eleven was just sticking out to me. So I saw it, but I kind of just like, you know, disregarded it and just kept going about my day. So this morning, God led me to scripture. Listen, he led me to Genesis 7, 11, right? And it says, in the 600th year of Noah's life, on the 17th day of the second month, on that day, all the springs of the great deep burst forth and the floodgates of heaven were open. Child, mm, I could have threw the whole phone in the trash can. So listen, God is just amazing, okay? God is faithful. He is beautiful. He is just no one or nothing compares to him okay god is faithful so listen in this hour god is saying the floodgates are heaven of heaven are open over your life okay this is the season of favor okay favor 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 like i said in my last video is your walk you gotta walk into places expecting to receive favor okay to be treated like royalty okay to be treated like a king's kid okay that's how you should be walking in that confidence in that confidence confidence in every room that you step up to okay so listen um um so this is confirmation for somebody that the floodgates of heaven are open so um, the thing, the topic of Christmas came early, child, listen, I don't know about y'all, but well, I do know about y'all cause y'all connected to me, which means whatever God does for me, he does for you too. And listen, let me just say something real quick. Cause I seen somebody in the comments, like, um, and I don't like to address people, but sometimes I do. Okay. So they was in the comments, like you shouldn't be bragging on what what god did for you because some of us still stuck here and i'm like well first of all i don't just get on videos and just brag as if i'm better than anybody else that's number one number two what i do is i will t give a testimony on what god did for me because if he can do it for me he could do it for you too it's the same way when i see other people get blessed with what i'm praying for i'm gonna get excited because i know that if god doing it for them he gonna do it for me too okay so that's just what i wanted to say so don't get discouraged when you hear somebody um, speak on their testimony of what God did for them. Like you should be getting excited and rejoice with your brothers and sisters. That's what the scriptures say, okay? Rejoice with your brothers and sisters and know that God could do it for you. If you're seeing it with your physical eye, then that means that it's confirmation that God is getting ready to do it for you too, okay? So listen, Christmas came early. There was something that I prayed for. Okay, like I told y'all, I had prayed for it and two days later, boom, it manifested. And literally in that hour, when I woke up this morning, God was just bringing back to my memory of all the things that I prayed for, even the prayers that I forgot, okay? My God, God said he's getting ready to bless you with things that you forgot that you even prayed about, okay? It could be little things, it could be big things, okay? But right now, you're probably praying for like one, two, maybe even three big things. But right now, God is saying, he is going to bless you, okay, exceedingly, abundantly, and above with more than what you asked for and answer the prayers that you even forgot about, okay? It's going to be an avalanche. And right there is a confirmation yesterday. Excuse me, y'all. Yesterday, I was driving um, and literally on this truck that stopped right in front of me, it said avalanche. And I started laughing because that's all God kept saying in this season was it's coming in an avalanche, right? Your blessings are literally getting ready to flood you, overtake you, okay? Well, you won't even have no room to receive all of the blessings that God is getting ready to bring you, okay? So this is a confirmation for somebody. You better believe it. Even though it's the day before Christmas, there are still miracles connected to your name on today, this day, your daily bread, okay? So if you're in that um, um, in that mindset or in that pit right now where the enemy might be trying to like test you or get on your nerves or whatever the case is, allow this video to renew your faith, okay? Because the moment that you change your perspective and change your mindset, I'm talking about instantly, like instantly get out your rut and instantly get out your temper tantrum and your attitude or whatever else you in, your sadness, your depression, instantly when you transform your mind or renew your mind and pray those things off you right and look at your day from a different perspective. When I tell you instantly miracles and blessings come, listen to me. Mark my words. If you change your perspective and your mindset in this moment into a gratitude mindset and 
choose to be happy and grateful on this day your daily bread there are so many miracles and blessings that are going to flood you on today okay and that's what god wants he wants to bless us okay he doesn't want to just bless us with the big things we're praying for but he's saying i want to bless you and, and bring you miracles and allow you to experience heaven on earth every single day that you wake up because every day that you wake up is a day that has never been touched before Today has never been touched before. Nobody has ever seen December 24th, 2021. Nobody in this world has seen it but us, but the ones that has woke up today, okay? So it's a brand new day. It's a fresh day. It's a day full of miracles and blessings, okay? So right now, God is just saying Christmas is coming early. Yes, the day before Christmas. Christmas is coming early, okay? Receive this prophetic word. And the second part was God saying the floodgates of heaven are open upon your life. My God, somebody is about to experience a major breakthrough. It's literally going to change the trajectory, the trajectory of your entire life, okay? My video, when I said you will no longer recognize your life, listen to me. You're going to go to sleep one day and wake up in a complete palace, okay? Literally, your life is not going to look the same, okay? So mark God's words when he says this. So I pray that this word blesses whoever it is intended to bless. I pray that it reaches those who it is for. And I pray that you, and I know that God will cover this word and that you have the faith to receive this word, to grab it, to know that it is yours, okay? God is saying he got you, my child. Christmas is coming early. He still has miracles and blessings with your name on it today okay today today not tomorrow but today okay this is a right now word okay so i love you all and i pray that you all have a beautiful and blessed holiday and amazing day today okay so i love you all until next time bye